Hey guys, Jedi Chronic here. I'm going to show you a quick way to drop the uh, general boss at the Ashina Castle uh, shrine. So that's where we're at, Ashina Castle. This is right after Blazing Bull. You can do this for a quick prayer bead. So there's a group of um, underlings up, up there, I guess regular foot soldiers. And in general, I definitely recommend not charging up the stairs. What we actually want to do is go... Uh, up here and get our first kill on that guy from uh, underneath. So we're going to go up here. Ignore that night jar. He's not going to follow us. Get up here and you will see Loudmouth down there surrounded by all his guys. So we are, uh, that guy with two death blows is the general. We're going to get a death blow on him from above, and then we're going to kill all these guys real quick, and then we'll come back and we'll deal with him just like uh, any other uh, general. Weird time to throw that tutorial up. So these guys are just one, two kills real quick. I'm going to give myself some space because he's already up. Make sure my heels are up. And I'm just going to lead him around while I kill these guys. Remember, when you're doing a death blow, you have uh, immunity. So you can get some iframes there. I'm going to let him chase me down here. And then I'm going to go take out this last gunman real quick. Now it's just me and the general. Boop. Just gonna deflect his nonsense. Not very well, I might add. Oh, I missed that Makiri. Are you serious? Didn't miss that one. I missed that one though, goodness. Come on, come on. The secret is just to get him on his own, to get him on his little lonesome. All right, how about some aggression? All right, I'm gonna back up and heal just a second. Come on. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Stomp over that guy. Come on, you got another Makiri jab you wanna throw at me? Okay. you didn't oh yeah you did so we're just gonna fence it out with him go on the offensive here So that combo you see me using over and over again to put some pressure on him is uh, floating passage. You unlock that combo uh, via treasure carp scales. I love, love, love the floating passage combo. It's basically the same moveset that Genichiro uses on you at the end of the tower uh, um, in the, the mid game. If you can go unlock floating passage, 
uh, go check out my video. You just have to basically get the Simpo Temple to get all the fish you need to, to make it happen. That makes putting pressure on guys like this uh, way, way easier. So we got a fair bead from him. Sorry that took me longer than it should have, guys. And then some divine grass there. I, I could use some divine grass. Uh, so that's how you clear this guy, get his prayer bead, and deal with all the, the dudes. Do not attack them from below. Get your first death blow from above. Then drop all these guys. And then fight him like any other general.